start with Tony Fauci because he's the guy that basically took the Wuhan Virology Lab behind me, gave him a bunch of money, gave him the tool to genetically engineer a deadly virus. I want to give you four reasons why this Wuhan Virology Lab is likely to be where the Tony Fauci virus came sure. from, funded by Fauci. Sure. CDC Director uh, Robert Redfield, Dr. Redfield, said, yeah, that's probably where it came from, is that he also said implicitly that it was a genetically engineered virus. But there's also yep. the fact that Fauci buddy Peter Daszak, the guy who laundered the money into the Wuhan lab, basically bragged about genetically engineered, said how easy it was to do this. So that's number two. So third thing's kind of interesting. This is my Occam's razor. This is the, the famous British philosopher who said that the simplest explanation of something is usually the most likely. So if I told you, Steve, that the only P4 weapons lab in all of Asia is located in Wuhan and a deadly virus uh, that's afflicting the world now showed up within a kilometer of that lab, you might jump to the reasonable Occam's razor conclusion that, yeah, that thing came from the lab. Now, the other thing here, a direct wow. progenitor is when uh, a virus jumps from a pangolin, an animal, to a human. Now, here's what's interesting, Steve. When the first SARS virus came in 2003, uh, it took them about a nanosecond to find the direct progenitor of that virus. Go to SARS-2 here, this, this deadly virus. It's over a year now, and scientists have looked at, at thousands and thousands of possibilities here. There is no direct progenitor of this virus in the animal kingdom, okay? The zoonotics, does not there. So the only thing that's left, Steve, is this lab behind me, the house that Tony Fauci built, seven million bucks of your money went to fund this lab, and while they were funding the lab, Tony Fauci said, hey, go in there and genetically engineer viruses to make them deadly, more deadly. And so giving you today four reasons why that place is where the pandemic started, and I've given you three reasons why Tony Fauci is part of that. QED, that's the proof. <laughs>